Most of us are so caught up in our story, we don't even notice the most obvious thing about it. Which is that we haven't got a clue what it is. There is no such thing as non-duality. I can't give you a definition of it because there's nothing to define. There is only one reality. The universe is not dual. It is something which transcends duality. Well, I think the question of non-duality has been the concern of human beings from the beginning of human civilization. There is no difference that's real. There is a difference that's relative. The word non-duality is just a pointer, and, it, and really it points to, to, to life, you know, to life as it's happening. Some people attempt to uh, explain this by making connection between brain processes and the fundamental level of the universe. When we think of consciousness, uh, we think of consciousness as a personal consciousness. It's I. What is the I? That's a very good question. What is the I? What is myself? Oh, it's made up. It's the ego. The I is an idea. It's, uh, it's basically a concept. I cannot even verify, really, if anybody else is having this experience of I. The true I must be the consciousness that perceives. I am knowledge and consciousness is. We are not the doer. We are that which is the instrument of the doer. I don't believe we have free will in the normal sense of free will, which is choosing what to do. If we look at it, we've just got like a moment by moment experience. We can't even say where this is coming from or where this is going. There's a hundred billion galaxies, <laughs> each one full of a hundred billion stars. And if you live to be 80, you have 4,000 weeks to understand that. Anyone who thinks they know what this is, is out of their mind.